we will study this power supply where is the problem assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh friends i have this modular power supply it is unserviceable we will see what is the problem first of all i will take uh, t size t10 yes vt10 screw driver दोस्तों ये मेरे पास एक फोइलेक्स की पावर सप्लाई है मॉड्यूलर पावर सप्लाई इसको हम रिपेयर करेंगे इसमें प्रॉब्लम ये है कि ये सिस्टम के अंदर लगी हुई थी और ये चल नहीं रही थी सरखेप सरखेप we will make an indication it is installed like this so i make a marking so when we will install back so now we will remove two screws here two screws here fiha har kathir mahrook fiha utr shorts we can see this capacitor got short circuited and it damaged oh my god it damaged many items so we have to see it is very badly damaged so i think it is very heavy damage we can see this capacitor also damaged so the circuit is also damaged very badly i will remove I think maybe it will very difficult to restore, but we will see what to do now. What was the problem? The problem is high voltage entered in this area, maybe due to lightning. otherwise uh, there is no reason that uh, have a big damage you can see these capacitors sixty three volt this also sixty three volt one hundred eighty microfarad and this capacitor have no rating you can see the condition of the board it is very heavy damage so we will see what we can do for this we will see if there is possible way i will i will wait and i will share with you what we can do for this one thanks for watching we will study this power supply where is the problem as i will discuss uh, the power supply is always how we can uh, some shoot so if we see here is input terminal 220 volt input filter 
filter and protection circuit and then any power supply it have rectifier circuit after that we have inverter circuit inverter circuit okay inverter circuit there is isolation transformer here we have rectifier circuit in normal power supplies we have rectifier okay in some power supplies such this it have a built-in regulator built-in regulator circuit so we can say and then there is feedback circuit this feedback circuit is directly connected to inverter circuit anytime if we have any problem in the output area rectifier area feedback circuit will disable the inverter so if I will demonstrate you this is this connector it is for feedback and this IC this optocoupler IC this decodes the sense of this circuit if we see here are two lines and there is one LED what is the function of this LED DC OK if this light is power on that means this portion is working properly when this circuit will work properly that means from here some voltage will go to operate this inverter like a simple power supply like there is no difference between this power supply and this power supply I repaired this power supply in my last video video you can see if you want to watch this video the same here is input filter circuit the filter capacitors like here small here is a big here is inductor coil here is inductor coil here is a bridge rectifier over there we have bridge rectifier here so we will check the components after that there is a FET field effect transistor MOSFET that is some time to regulate the voltage this capacitor because this time we are making study what was the reasons of this power supply failure so this capacitor is safe that means the input say input area is okay there is no problem in input area where is the problem the problem in output regulator what is in output regulator there is a FET field effect transistor and there are output capacitors if this circuit have uh, lose the control for uh, the regulator it will damage everything so here here we have a driver if we see we have different transformers here here is driver and one driver is here that is on board for monitoring the inverter to drive this uh, this one because this connector is connected here and it takes drive from this field effect transistor so this area is safe because this one it takes drive from there and it generates voltage over here so our this area got problem maybe any drive because it is DC voltage here if this DC voltage got problem from anywhere else 
so this FET and everything damaged and it is my opinion it is my experience because uh, we have to find the issue this one is output regulator area this is output regulator it is out 20, 48 volt 48 volt out then there is no reason any load connected here any load connected here here is over current sensor this resistor is connected here to sense this resistor this damaged very badly and these capacitors this 63 volt 63 volt capacitors that means this system can never generate more than 63 volt because it have regulator it have pre-regulator it have rectifier so this area I hope so it is safe I hope so and we will make troubleshooting there are two options the first option may be the lightning resistor or uh, in the output area even if the output is short circuited then there is no reason that it can damage because it is directly controlled to this regulator IC here is operational amplifier it immediately stops the drive you can see it can never burn out like this so this coil is a DC choke it is used as a DC choke I removed it so we have thank you for watching and I will discuss all the circuit step by step I will open this now I will remove the heat sink really I am so disappointed on this loss no problem we will see the best solution we can do